So we're here today, we're going to discuss the three types of mangroves we can find here in southwest, southwest Florida, which are the red mangrove, the black mangrove, and the white mangrove. And I'm actually in between two of the species. The first one we're going to discuss is the red mangrove. Um, and the way you can identify mangroves, there's a couple different ways. So the first one we'll discuss is the leaves. The red mangrove has very shiny, very pointy green leaves, which are green on both sides of the leaf. Okay. Now if you're looking at the black mangrove, it's still pointy, but it's a little less shiny, and it's got a gray back. Okay, so those are, that's a nice way to see it, and I'll pull off one of each of these leaves, which you're not technically supposed to do. So we can compare, we'll get the third one too. Um, another way to tell is by the root system. Okay, so here we've got the red mangrove, which has its nice crop roots. It's called the walking tree, and so it's got roots that seem to come out from the tree outside of the soil and go down. So it looks actually like it's walking out. If you see these walking roots, you know you're looking at a red mangrove. Finally is the propagule, which luckily we've got some great examples here. Um, the propagule is actually a live tree. This is how the tree reproduces. It is a seed-like structure, but instead of being a seed, it's a, it's a baby tree. And the red mangrove has these cigar-shaped propagules. So again, to summarize, the red mangrove Pointy, shiny leaves, greens on both sides. It has this sort of prop root, walking root system, and it's got these cigar-shaped propagules. So our third type of mangrove here in southwest Florida is the white mangrove. Uh, the easiest way to identify the white mangrove is by the leaves, and it has really rounded leaves, as opposed to the black and the white that are pointy. This one is rounded, and it's shiny on both sides. And I'm gonna pull this off so we can take a look at all three leaves. So you can see how the black mangrove, the red mangrove are pointy, and the white is rounded. Also on the white, if you can see it, right down here, there are two little nodules at the base of the leaf. The scientists believe that actually secretes sugar, but that's another good identifier for the white mangrove. So here's actually the front of all three leaves, rounded. It's not really the front. So here's the back of all three leaves. So you can see the difference if they don't blow away on me. The back of all three leaves, again, is an identifier. If you're looking at a gray back, you're looking at the black mangrove. Okay, green back with the pointy leaf, red, rounded is white. The root system of the white mangrove can vary, so it's not really a good identifier for the white mangrove. Okay, so if you want to identify, I mentioned earlier, one way to identify mangroves is through their root systems. Um, this is sort of an interesting example because you have mixed root systems here. But one thing you want to look for with the black mangroves is the pencil-like pneumatophores, okay? So what we're talking about are these guys here. This is the root system of the black mangrove. So if you see this, you're going to know you're, you're around black mangroves. And you'll notice that intermixed in that is some of these prop roots of the red mangroves. Another way to identify mangroves, as I mentioned, is the propagules. Uh, and luckily right now on these trees, we only have the propagule of the red mangrove. But what you're gonna be looking for is the cigar-shaped propagule is the red mangrove. The smallest propagule is a white mangrove. And then the middle size that's shaped somewhat like a teardrop is the black mangrove. 